I remember better days. Happiness is bullshit. You think Picasso was happy? You think Hemingway was? No art worth a damn was ever created out of happiness, I can tell you that much. That's why we're all such miserable assholes. So you know you're a miserable asshole. What, do you think I'm an idiot? Of course I know. We pay a lot of lip service to great actors. We think we know what they're going to do. But the really great actors, when we see them again on screen, they go past our expectations. They do what we think they're going to do, and they do a whole lot more. That's what makes them great. This is courtesy of my thoughts on Ed Harris, star of a new film called Kodachrome. Ed Harris has been nominated for Academy Award four times. We all know what an accomplished actor he is, but the stuff he does in Kodachrome is really breathtaking. He plays a photographer, world-class photographer, who's trying to reunite with his son because he's dying. He's also trying to get some rolls of Kodachrome film developed before the processing for that film ends. This photographer is a real nasty person. He's a real son of a bitch. No one plays characters like this, like Ed Harris, but Ed Harris finds layers in this character. He finds meaning in this character. He takes this character in directions you're going to be surprised by, even if you think you know what he's going to do. Jason Sudeikis is in this film as well, Elizabeth Olsen, they're fine, but the real reason to see this film is Ed Harris. It's to see what a great actor does. For the Los Angeles Times, this is Kenneth Duran.